outside of Congresswoman Lucy McBath's office. She is one of the Congresswomen in the freshman class who won in 2018 in a district that President Trump won in 2016. I'm going over with a group of constituents of hers to go inside the office because she's supposed to be representing them. Wait, let me make sure we understand that. The Congresswoman's only gonna talk to two of her constituents? Oh, her office is said only two people can go see her. Yes, this is a private bill. No, but she's not. No, no, she, she's my congressperson. We're tired of this witch hunt. We're tired of this phony impeachment inquiry. This is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Everyone I told you has to say that. Oh, is that going to go so She's this only going to see three of us at a time. She is a public congresswoman, and her office is not public. Yes, it is. 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 Okay. You are actually, you work for us. I'd like to see it. So, it's because a safety it's a policy, concern. It's the door is locked. You can't be disrupted. I actually stayed downstairs because I noticed a couple of people scooting out of the building, and I followed them and saw that they went and called 911 on these constituents who wanted to talk to their congresswoman. She said, call 911. Call 911 because constituents are coming? You're calling 911 for constituents? Lucy McBath's staffers are calling 911 because constituents want to talk to the staff to tell them they don't want to see her allow this witch hunt to continue against President Trump. I want the camera to pan all of these people that Lucy McBath thinks are dangerous and are a threat to her. We have to send a message to Washington. Please make time on Thursday, October the 10th to visit your local congressional office. You can go to trumpdefenseteam.com, trumpdefenseteam.com, and you can get a list of all the local offices in your state.